Every May to June, during the rainy season, Yoro is hit by tropical thunderstorms, dark clouds, lightning, and wind. Then, the rain clears, and small silvery fish appear alive in the streets. The event can occur one to four times per year, making it an annual phenomenon, not just a freak incident. Scientists suggest that water spouts, tornadoes that form over water, could lift fish from rivers or the Atlantic Ocean and deposit them inland. But Yoro is approximately 72 kilometers, 45 to 125 miles from the nearest sea, making this theory plausible for short distances, but not fully convincing. A rival hypothesis, fish emerge from underground cave systems or rivers, displaced by heavy rainfall, appearing to have fallen from the sky. A 1970s National Geographic team observed that the fish were blind freshwater species, suggesting a subterranean habitat rather than from the sea.